Hello, you're watching the Auto Advisor channel. Are you considering buying an electric car? With the dawn of a new era of sustainable transportation, electric cars are becoming a popular choice for many. They're sleek, they're whisper quiet, and they're kind to the environment. But despite their growing popularity, they're not without their drawbacks. It's essential to be aware of these before you take the plunge and invest in an electric vehicle. So before you make your decision, let's delve into the six major problems with electric cars. First on the list is the limited driving range and speed. Electric vehicles, while they are making strides in efficiency and performance, still lag behind their gasoline counterparts in terms of driving range. A typical electric car can cover anywhere between 100 to 300 miles on a single charge, whereas a gasoline car can easily cover over 300 miles, making it more suited for long-distance drives. Furthermore, speed is another area where electric cars may not meet the mark for some. While they offer impressive acceleration, the top speed of most electric cars is generally lower than that of gasoline cars. This may not be an issue for city driving, but for those who enjoy the thrill of high speeds or need to travel on highways regularly, this could be a point of contention. So, for those of you who are into speed and long drives, this might be a drawback. Secondly, there's the issue of long recharge time. It's important to remember that electric cars, while environmentally friendly, can't be topped up as quickly as their petrol and diesel counterparts. Imagine you're used to a five-minute pit stop at your local petrol station. Now, replace that with a recharge time that can last from 30 minutes to a whopping 12 hours for a full charge, depending on the type of charger and the specific model of the car. Now, let's think about those of us with packed schedules. Those who are always racing against the clock. Those who value every minute. The time it takes to recharge an electric car could become more than an inconvenience. It could become a roadblock, a hurdle, a spanner in the works of a well-oiled routine. So, if you're always on the go, this might be a problem to consider. Thirdly, let's discuss the availability of charging stations. Picture this. You're cruising along in your shiny new electric car, only to find that your battery is nearing empty. You pull out your phone to find the nearest charging station, but alas, the closest one is miles away. This is a reality for many electric car owners, especially in rural areas where charging stations are few and far between. Now contrast this with the convenience of owning a traditional fuel-powered car. Gas stations are plentiful and strategically located, making refueling a breeze. But for electric car owners, the scarcity of charging stations can be a real inconvenience. You might have to plan your trips around the availability of charging stations, or worse, risk getting stranded. The bottom line is this. While electric cars are undoubtedly the future, infrastructure has some catching up to do. If you live in an area with few or no charging stations, owning an electric car might pose some challenges. Fourthly, electric cars come with a high upfront cost. If you've ever taken a look at the price tag on an electric vehicle, you might have noticed that it's significantly higher than its gasoline-powered counterpart. This isn't a coincidence. The technology that powers these vehicles, from the advanced batteries to the electric drive systems, is still relatively new and thus more expensive to produce. Let's break it down a little. The battery, being the heart of the electric vehicle, accounts for a large portion of the cost. It's not just a simple battery, but a complex piece of technology that requires a significant investment to manufacture. Then there's the electric drive system, another essential component that propels the vehicle without a traditional engine. It's an intricate system that also contributes to the overall cost. So, before you take the plunge and buy an electric car, remember that the initial purchase price is quite steep. While you might save on fuel costs in the long run, the initial cost of buying an electric car is something to consider. Fifthly, there's a limited range of models available. In contrast to the vast selection of gasoline-fueled cars, the electric car market offers a significantly smaller pool to choose from. This could be a bit of a bummer for all you car enthusiasts out there who relish the thrill of having a multitude of options at your disposal. From sedans to SUVs, sports cars to family wagons, the electric car segment is yet to match the variety offered by its gasoline counterparts. If you're someone who likes variety and options, this might be a drawback. 
Lastly, let's discuss the cost of battery replacement. Electric car batteries, like all batteries, have a finite lifespan. Although they're designed to last for many years, they won't last forever. When the time comes for replacement, the cost can be significantly high. This financial implication might be a shock to some electric car owners. You see, while electric cars can save you a good chunk of change on fuel costs over their lifetime, the savings can be offset by the expense of a new battery. The cost varies depending on the make and model of your car, but it's safe to say that it won't be a drop in the bucket. Sure, some manufacturers offer battery warranties, but these generally only cover you for a certain number of years or miles. Once you're out of warranty, you're on your own. So, while electric cars can be cost-effective in terms of fuel, the cost of battery replacement is something to consider. So, there you have it. The major problems with electric cars. From the limited driving range and speed to the long recharge time, charging station availability, high upfront cost, limited models available and battery replacement costs, these issues can't be ignored. No doubt these cars are a leap towards a cleaner and more sustainable future, but they do come with their fair share of challenges. Before you make the leap, it's crucial to weigh these problems against the undeniable benefits of owning an electric car. Remember, electric cars offer lower running costs, fewer emissions, and a silent, smooth driving experience. Yet, they may also require a shift in lifestyle and some additional expenses. Whether or not an electric car is right for you will ultimately depend on your personal circumstances and preferences. So do your research. Consider these points and make an informed decision.